Two people were found dead in a South Dallas home this afternoon. Police responded to the scene near Belknap Avenue and Sutter Street, and that's where we find Jack Fink this afternoon with the details. Jack? Gilma, you can still see Dallas police out here working this scene. Detectives are inside that red brick house behind me in this neighborhood south of Illinois and east of Lancaster Road. And this double homicide comes just five days before Christmas. Police aren't giving many details about what happened, but a relative tells us a woman in her 50s and her adult son in his 30s were shot and killed by her living boyfriend of five years. The relative says police are looking for him now and that the boyfriend and the woman's son didn't get along. A neighbor told me she heard four gunshots early this morning, but when she came outside, didn't see any suspicious activity. The relative says the woman's co-worker's beau became concerned this morning when she didn't show up for work. They came to her house, and when no one came to the door, they called police. And police tell us when they arrived, they made their way inside and found the two dead. The relative, Pamela Williams, tells us she spoke with her earlier this week and said her boyfriend was very controlling. When I talked to her two days ago, and she was just talking real strange, I said, why haven't you called me? And she was talking real, real strange. She said, well, you have the wrong number. She hung up, but that's why I knew something was wrong. Police are not identifying the victims just yet. Williams said she called back that day, but the woman didn't answer the phone. She said her son leaves behind three young boys, ages two, three, and six. And she had plans, the woman had plans to go up and see her other daughter and grandchildren in Ohio for Christmas. Police are asking the public if they have any information about what happened here to give them a call. Live in Dallas, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.